Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, as you may have guessed from the title, this is another Valentine's Day makeup look for you guys. So I always seem to do this every year. So I have partnered with Yastel once again. This is not in any way sponsored, but they were nice enough to send me all of this stuff for me to share with you guys. As we all know, Valentine's Day is just around the corner. Today is Sunday. I'm filming this on a Sunday and it's gonna be like a week before Valentine's Day that I'm filming this but I thought it'll be fun to share with you guys my makeup look that I wanted to do for Valentine's Day which is this one so they actually sent me four items that I used for today's makeup look the first one they sent me is this one Kill Cover Cleo which is um, a glowing cushion foundation I love anything cushion from Korean because we all know it's gonna be super super duper glowy um, as you can see from my face right now this is the foundation that I used and also I'll be using the Moni from McQueen New York this is the eyeshadow palette that they sent me this is actually the neutral eyeshadow palette honestly like create the most simple and a versatile um, eye color using all the shades this is the, my typical everyday shade so that's why i'm very very excited for this one and then they also sent me wake make a vitamin watery talk tinted lip balm in glowing red this is what it looks like and this is my favorite lip balm you guys like look at this shade and this is the shade that i'm actually using on my lips right now it looks very very simple and i love that it's very 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 moisturizing especially because it's winter right now in canada the last one that they sent me is actually a vegan eyeliner from Maison. i love the packaging and everything and it is a really really sharp one can we talk about this really really cute earrings that i got from yesdal i'm gonna leave all of this link down below you guys but this is so cute. If you guys wanted to see how I create this look, then please keep on watching. Okay, let's start off the makeup. I don't have anything on my face. I just did um, my eyebrows. Yesel sent me four items and they are all here. And let me show you guys what I got. So first, the Kill Cover um, Glow Fitting Cushion. I hope you can see that it's just really bright outside and i got the shade linen which is number 21 i'm always number 21 because of how pale my skin is so this would be really really good Ooh. i like cushions that came with a refill so this is the refill if i ever run out of the cushion i can always put the refill which is good i love cleo this is what it looks like the cushion looks like this and it has this is very very satisfying so let me take out this one and then it has a puff that looks like this and then when you open it it looks like that i wish it's not gonna be too too light although i am so pale right now because of the winter i honestly can't wait for the summer you guys um so this is what the shade looks like first let me put something on my lips because it's super dry right now but they also sent me this one which is the vitamin watery talk tinted lip balm which is perfect because i honestly need a lip balm so the packaging reminds me so much of like fenty beauty for some reason um and i got the shade 02 which is glowing red very nice and oh okay that's good so this is like a lip balm but really really red mm. i like how smooth this is and it has a lot of pigmentation now that i have a color in my lips i pulled you guys closer so that you can see the cushion foundation and what it's gonna look like on my skin again this is shade 21 oh my gosh this is full of 
product like i didn't even press too too hard and it's like a lot of product so let's try i didn't put any primer i honestly don't use any primer anymore you guys i just i always just use like the foundation as is or a tinted moisturizer and i never bother putting any primer on i just don't feel like i need it um so yeah and that's also one of the reasons why i love korean products because if you like korean makeup that means you like very natural looking skin like look at that glow this is what i love about um cushion foundations from korea i honestly just picked up a new um foundation refill for my um clavu one which i just got the other day um and i love using that that one has a lot more coverage than this one this for some reason is just very very light it doesn't give a lot of coverage it just gives you like a really nice canvas but you can still see your skin if that makes sense it is one layer done you can still see some of my blemishes right here so I like it though it looks very very natural but let me try to build it up and see if it's gonna be more coverage but yeah okay so it is buildable which is nice oh did i mention that this is like a glowing cushion yeah so this is a glowing cushion so it's supposed to give you this amazing glow on your skin which is perfect for valentine's day it gives off this no makeup makeup look vibe that we always go for during valentine's day i'm not sure about you guys but honestly not the type of person that likes to um put a lot of makeup i like natural looking makeup especially if it's gonna be for valentine's day i want to look very very natural okay so this is two layers done i so far i really really like it so now i'm just gonna go ahead and put some contour or bronzer on my face because this is very very light and it washes out my color so i'm just gonna bring back some of the color back and i'm gonna be using my favorite contour which is dior and i'll be right back okay i am back so i did a little bit of bronzer just to kind of shape my face and i used the dior backstitch contour palette which is the 001 universal i really really love this um so this is what i use if you guys are interested and then i just put a little bit of blusher on my face using the hourglass so this is what i use this two together just to give me a little bit of rosy cheeks next thing that i'll be doing is the eyes so yes they also sent me two items for the eyes so the first one is this um mcqueen 001 tone up tone on tone shadow pale brown mood that is a mouthful so i got a palette from them Ooh, so this is what it looks like um i can already tell what i want to do on my eyes for this um palette using this palette so this is what it looks like it has nine shades and this is just your typical neutral eyeshadow palette which i really really like but before that they also sent me an eyeliner so this is vegan eyeliner from maison it's long lasting vegan liquid eyeliner with a comfortable applicator to create ultra black intense looks so when i saw this one um i immediately was so excited to use this because i feel like this is the type of eyeliner that i've been wanting to get for so long i've always been on a hunt for a really really matte looking eyeliner and i think i might have found the one so we'll see about that later when i use this so the tip looks like that it's very very short i'm excited to use this but first let's go beat up my eye it's really hard to do it without 
um, mirror but let's try so I'm gonna just be putting this color for my eyelids I hope you can see what I'm doing here you guys let me go ahead and actually use this color right here So the next thing I'm gonna do is actually use this one. It's really pigmented. I'm not even like, I'm not really digging my brush into it, but it's so, so pigmented already. So I'm just packing the glitter on my eyelids. I don't know if it's not, it's, if it's showing, but that's that. I'm going to be using this shade for the inner corner of my eye just to give it a little bit more oomph. With this one, I can tell that it's probably best to use my finger. Yeah. It's, a, it's the kind of glitter that is kind of like bigger specs. See how that just showed up even more when I did that so I hope the camera is doing it justice that's really pretty wow and now that, that I'm happy with it I'm gonna go ahead and use this shade for my under eye just a little bit Now that that's done, I'm going to be using the eyeliner. This is going to be hard. I haven't done eyeliner in a long, long time. So, wish me luck. Wow, this is actually so intense. Like, it's really black. Well, that's the eyeliner. I'm gonna be doing the other side and show you guys what it looks like. Hey guys, I am back and this is the final look. I just put um, fake lashes on, give it a little extra oomph. And I just paired it. I decided to wear like just a white shirt in general i got this from yesdal as well that's just a plain white oversized relaxed shirt i kind of just wanted to do a very very simple uh, valentine's day makeup look today and yeah i do have a lot more valentine's um outfit that i wanted to share with you guys but that's going to be on the other video that is also from yesdal um so but this one is my absolute favorite the fabric is so so soft and i feel like if it's like a date night i wanted it to be like super relaxed super chill and just i just want to be myself this is my take on the valentine's day makeup look for this year and it's just really really fun to do this with you guys again i do this every year um together with yes style as always if you guys want to shop from yes style i do have a coupon code which you can use on top of their existing promo code at the moment so my code is trinas10 for 10 percent off your entire purchase and they also offer free shipping and all that so yeah that is it for this video i hope you guys like it and enjoy it as much as i did as always if you have any questions just leave them down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video i i swear you guys if you ended up not liking me you can always unsubscribe and that's fine but for today please subscribe to my channel to see more of my videos coming soon i'm very very excited for all of the videos that i am going to put out for this year so yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you on my next one bye